Welcome back to the 18th episode of a close combat Wacht am Rhein playthrough and uh, this time we're fighting off the uh, Kampfgruppe Hansen here in Weilo with the allies. We are obviously still playing as them. Um, yeah, this uh, 28th Infantry Division has a couple of showmans to its name, so that's pretty decent. Um, the enemy's got the Jagdpanzer as well, it's easier to see what they got if we actually look uh, on the list here. So let's see, Vila, this is this map again, alright. Okay, Ooh, wow, they got a lot of Jagdpanzers, but I don't think giving them too many Jagdpanzers is actually a good thing for the enemy. If I'm being honest. They're not really, I mean they're good. It's not that, but it's, they don't have a turret or anything, so, I don't know. We'll give them a group of, uh... I know, we'll uh, suck trip them up, and then we'll give them uh, some Panzer Grenadiers with MG and whatever. Then I think we'll give them four of these and a Panzer Pioneer. Actually, let's see what I got here. So, so we kind of mix and match it. Uh, oh no, what am I doing? Uh, the moving team should have experience, so that's no bueno. Uh, let's see, these teams are inexperienced. The Sherman. Well, it has experience, but a couple of injured crew members, which might not matter, actually. Uh, got three bazooka teams, might as well pour in anti-tank guns. For now, anyway. Do I just... Load them up with ten of these? I haven't done that before, I guess. Now we do. Let's go. I honestly wish you didn't have the chance to edit the enemy, but also that you didn't have a chance to see what the fuck the enemy's coming in with. Right? The game would be better if you couldn't do these two things, I think. I mean, now I can edit so I make it more challenging. Arguably, but it's like, I don't fucking know. It would be more challenging to face an enemy when you don't know what he has. You know? This makes more sense to me, at least. Anyway, let's uh, maybe get the Tordical team posted up in the uh, four-story building here. And uh, bazooka teams. Well, I want one aiming down this road. Gonna set up pretty identical to last time we played here. Might be a bit heavy on anti-tank guns if I'm honest. Like it might not be good to have this many. And sneak the bazooka. <clears throat> the bazooka team here, oh, sorry I had to clear my throat, um, and just kind of, with a little bit of reprehension, basically, don't want to go too hard with them. Could maybe get a bazooka team in position over here as well. Then we have the bar team, which, let's put them here maybe, on ambush. The rifle team, where are they? Here, we'll put them in here on ambush. Oh no, that's platoon leader. That's not even matter though. Let's just go with the platoon leader there. It's fine. Where is the rifle team? Okay, oh, here. I was looking around like, where the hell are they? There you go, there it is. And yeah, put them here so they can uh, cover towards this area if they push up there. They did last time, as you can see from the uh, tank wrecks in the area. So maybe they do again. Um, 57mm anti-tank gun. Can we maybe get that in the building somewhere? They are tiny enough to fit usually, so... Yeah, here. Yeah, yeah that's that's probably good. Uh, the 3 inch though, that's like the main... I think we should have definitely a 3 inch here. If I can click it in in a good place. Like I think it doesn't have to be good enough, I guess. Uh, nuance, this isn't the strong suit of this game always. And uh, what do I put another one? I mean, I could put one here, maybe. I did last time. Not sure that worked out so well, though. But it might, I guess. Also might not. Um... Hmm. Shoot it through here. Might work. I don't know. I don't know. 
Do we have another few 57 mils? We can put one here for sure. That's a good position, I think. Probably put two in here, actually. Yeah, just get good coverage. Heck, why not even put in three? Just for shits and giggles. Oh, okay, there's some reasons why not. They can't really clip in properly. But hey, maybe we can get uh, oh, we can get one in here. And they have a tendency to not get seen when they're in buildings shooting out, so... Let's hope that's going to be the case this time around as well. And Sherman here. That should work. And a Sherman behind the church over here. It'll be able to shoot out. Oh, well, it'll also be able to take fire. Yeah, I'm just going to have it on the back burner here. Then we'll move it out later. So I think this is going to work. The curve. Yeah, that's probably fine. That's pretty good. Okay, they got a lot of tins on the north here. But these anti tank guns aren't going to be as effective as I would have hoped that they would. Necessarily. Um, yeah, I probably sneak the Bazooka team in here. Yeah, see, the thing is, you give the enemy all this stuff, it's, we're just farming it down, really. I mean, it might be boring to watch, it's cheesy, it's better to have, like, a... It's more interesting if there's a bit of infantry and, like, a few tanks on each side, right? Like, two tanks on each side, for instance. Because then the tanks feel more valuable. It's not, like, only tanks. I don't know. I don't know. We'll let them make some moves. Shoot them when they do. Should be good. Which isn't, like, interesting combat, if you ask me, but... Well, I'm giving them the best stuff that they have. They just don't know how to use it, because the AI is kind of trash, so... There you have it. Take my three. Oh, I'm shooting the infantry now. Okay, wow, we took out the entire squad, though. What the hell? In one hit? Pretty crazy, actually. Okay, three down over here. Four, five, it's just farming. Farming Yag Panzers, basically. That's what I'm doing right now. If this was a RPG game, this would be probably akin to farming a low tier level, I feel like. Playing against the AI like this with these kinds of compositions. But it's, I don't know, like 10 of these, it's, that's really dangerous stuff. Really, if you just apply them properly, which the AI doesn't. Yeah, we can have a ceasefire once I get that last victor location there in my hands. We can certainly have a ceasefire then. Oh, did I hit the wrong one? Look at that, very nice. Okay, well... I mean, the 57 mil ones are really kicking in good. Absolutely sufficient for uh, for these uh, Jagdpanzers, apparently. I have one left or something. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Three left. Right. All right. Well, we just take it easy. The other one's attacking. We're gonna have to make the move, so. I don't need to risk my tanks or anything just yet, I feel, so we'll just have a little bit of patience. Wait a few more minutes. Don't want to move my infantry in, uh, sorry, my tanks in, as there might be enemy infantry that has panzer fire, so they could just fire off at them. So, yeah. Oh, it's not a good hit. Whoa, what the hell is this thing glitching out the bat? Got to mobilize, that's good. Not going anywhere now. Two left after this. I knew it, they would be better off with more infantry. But I feel like I'm, I'm giving them the highest point score shit they could have pretty much, right? Not not quite, but not far away from it either. Okay, we took out the two MG teams, but that means they have all the infantry that still has the panzer fast. Or, that has the panzer fast still in action. So we got eight. Jagdpanzers, dead, and, hmm. Yeah, I 
kind of want to move into tanks, but also if I do, it's uh, probably not going to be too good to actually be doing that. We can move in some infantry, try to get some ice on these last, uh, these last two. Let's see if we can maybe get some moves made to take them on. Well, shots coming from here. Yeah. Let's fire at it. Let's just pummel that slurp shot. If we can. And we can. So, let's pummel it. Oh, I had a these things exactly on where those two muscle flashes came out from. Okay, that's, that one's still alive, right? I don't have any team info on it, so I'm guessing yes. Just gonna be careful with my showman now. No. Start shooting at any infantry we can pop that. Alright. Well. That one's still up and running, seemingly. Yeah, let's move the bazooka team in as well, huh? These seem absolutely useless, they're not even... What is the enemy doing with these? You know what? Let's have the showman maybe back out there, then drive forward here, come out, shoot this guy in the side, something like this. Platoon lead on ambush. Uh... Yeah, I'm aware of that. Oh, there we go. We have shots on that now. That's good. If we can immobilize it, then uh, that's half the job done already. Alright, well. Yeah, let's hold the... Uh... Ah, fuck it. Is he reversing? He actually turned around. No, he didn't. Okay, good. Turn, turn the gun around, though. Okay. We got that. So, can we get the... Uh... Last one here with a showman, hopefully? Kind of sucks this condition. Wow, what the fuck is that reaction? What even is that reaction? But how is he shooting? He's aiming this way, but he's shooting the gun there. Fuck, this game is so weird sometimes. It's like frustratingly weird. It's not like, oh, that's funny. It's weird in that way. How funny is that? No, it's just, what the fuck is that? Oh no, misfire. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can do this, you can do this, you can do this. You couldn't stop and aim while he had a chance. You bloody idiot, now you're mobilized. Super teams ain't gonna fire. Very nice, very nice. Why isn't this thing firing? God damn. Come on, boys, fire. Ah, damn it, there goes that showman. Shouldn't have moved it in. And I fucking knew I shouldn't. I knew it. Should've just used the bazooka. Oh, fuck me. Uh, yeah, we can't move anything to safety here, either. But can you please hit, please? No, did not hit. Okay. Well, uh, what I can do is move this bell team up a little bit, I guess. Over here. And, uh, fuck me, we are absolutely getting obliterated over here. Just... The bazooka teams in this game are just a pain to operate. They just don't do anything. I honestly, I hate the bazooka teams in this game. In this game. This specific game. It's like they're just programmed to be shit. For like, unknown reasons. There's no good reason for them to be shit. They're just shit because they're programmed to be it or something. Like, I don't even know. I don't even know what it's for. Do we need to pull back though? I don't think we do, you see. I think we need to get the bazooka teams firing at the enemy. I think that's what we need to do. Oh, you are joking. Come on. Come on, we'll loosen the ball team. Fuck that artillery strike. It hit hard. 
Um, well, if, if this guy didn't get the showman, then the artillery strike probably would have, so. Yeah, busy being shit, right? Come on, fucking shoot. Okay. Come on, you can do it, boys. You can do it, boys. Stop being shit. Stop being good. Okay, we're gonna move into show them a little bit, which is risky. Due to them having infantry teams over here that has panzer fast, but... Maybe we get lucky, it's damaged now. We certainly didn't take out its um, cannon, though. No ammo left. There's a bazooka team there they can scavenge from, but bazooka teams in this game seem to not really scavenge. For whatever reason. Alright, well, I don't want to cease fire. Oh, they hit! They took it out. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna move the bazooka team in here. Then, and, uh. Yeah, fuck it. Let's move this bazooka team in as well. Just over here, take that victory location. Gotta pummel this stuff over here as much as we can as well. Uh, yeah. Well, we took a lot of casualties, but we did win the battle. Possibly. Probably. Most likely we won the battle. There are still two enemy infantry squads around. Let's say two are meant three. One here, one there, and one in an unknown position. Two Panzer Pioneers, I believe, and... Oh no, Grenadiers, I mean. Regular Panzer Grenadiers. And, um... The Silk Truck. Oh, grenades coming out. Okay, better be careful. Get defending, get defending, keep alive. Alright, ah, this is a command team or some shit. Well, we know one of them, are, but we know the other two are here, so... I'm just gonna hope and pray that they miss with the Panzer, uh, Panzer Shrek. I always say, I almost always say Panzer Faust instead of Shrek for whatever reason. What's the distance of? Uh, just outside a uh, Panzer Shrek range. Faust. Faust, I mean. Yeah, well, that's how it goes sometimes. So I just wanna... We haven't completely taken the map, but we might be able to push through her still, though. Just need this team to not get a pass. Are you joking? Are you fucking joking with this fucking AI pathing right there? What is this? What is this? Holy fuck. I just don't even... I don't have words, at least no nice words for it. You have to fucking waypoint like a goddamn micromanagement babysitting course like this. So is there any issues? Any reason why you can't drive? What the fuck's going on? Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. What do you just really want to drive into the shed here? What the fuck? Oh my god. I mean, come on! Is the driver drunk? Move! There! Don't go into the trees! You're gonna mobilize yourself, you stupid shit! On your feet, soldier. Yeah, well, on his feet, underneath his feet are a couple of pedals. And he's not using them right. Go, oh, that way. Don't fucking drive around like zigzagging across like it's a fucking true equator Olympic or something. I mean, it's like, yes, I'll go from A to B 100 meters around there. I'm just going to go through equator first. Fuck off with that shit. I mean, he's driving inside the trees. Why? There's a risk of being immobilized when you do that. Oh my god. My lord. Oh, come on. Just, just, just get over there. Take the victory location. They're even like an experienced crew. 
doesn't look like it. it does not look like any one of these crew members that have any prior experience with driving anything at all there we go truce please immediately thank you okay we won so we took out the regiment of the enemy slow but just oh my god man sometimes it's a bit frustrating not gonna lie <laughs> my lord this pathing either way thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it if you did i would appreciate if you smack down a like on this video hell would uh help me out and all that so you know well either way you can catch me in the next one have a good one